our latest install of the five zone hyperheating system uh, down there in Chicago. We're looking at uh, this is a 6000 GL model and uh, two bedrooms upstairs. That's it, it's a Cape Cod style. I'll show you the other side real quick and then before we run downstairs. All right, and this is the front bedroom. We came in through the knee wall area over there and uh, brought it up to the unit with some covers with some line hide. It's not any attic space or anything up above, so uh, looks really good in here. Nice and cool, which I've never had before, so I'm sure they'll be uh, ecstatic with it. We're going downstairs real quick before we go outside. Here, hold on. You know what? This is uh, FH 18,000 BTU in the living area on the first floor. And uh, it'll take care of the living area and kitchen uh, space pretty readily. And we got one over here in the bedroom as well, which is on the back of the house. So this one and one upstairs is on the back of the house on the line height, which you'll see in a bit. And then, uh, of course, it goes to the branch box. We'll go up down and take a look at that as well. All right, and here is our branch box. So we got uh, some lines going through there here. This goes underneath the stairwell and uh, goes into the basement, which then goes back outside. And I'll show you that in a minute. And of course, we got our line set. One line set comes in from the condenser, and then the other two sets of uh, lines that are going out to the units that are going to the back of the house. Okay, we'll come through here. And here is our 12,000 ETU GL model, which is for the basement level area. And this is where we came, so this is going out through the side. This is where we popped out from underneath the stairwell, out of the utility room there. And we're going back outside with our line set, which go for the unit both here in the basement. And then we have another unit above, which is the one we saw in the living room with the, the orange colored wall and the front bedroom. So all of that is going there. So you can see we have a, it's a six inch cover. It'll be the same outside. Pops out on the end there, comes up, and goes to the knee wall area in the back. This goes down to the basement and end up here. See where we had to pop out right below the gutter. That goes to the uh, living room. Excuse me, that goes into the bed front bedroom. Sorry, uh, drain, and then the cover on the top of the line height up there. That goes into the living area. Walk into the back. Pause real quick. All right, here we are in the back of the house. We got our 48,000 hyperheating outdoor unit here. You can see up top up here is where the, by the window, top window, it goes to the back bedroom. And then the other one to the right goes to the bedroom on the first floor. And then this other one, everything kind of comes back over here uh, behind this hole. And uh, there used to be a, like a foam filled hold there, which made it nice for access, but the, uh, that's where we go into the branch box from the outdoor unit, and then we're coming back out to do these two uh, lines on the back to the, the outdoor units. So we're running right now all the units inside. And we've got our quick sling stand. Everybody's running nicely. Drain routed off. So, this is Mike with Compass Heating and Air, and this is our latest. Z five zone as you can see with the cottonwood floating around they're gonna have a lot of cleaning to do out here during our cottonwood area a cottonwood season so uh, anyway this is Mike with compass heating and air off in the states have a good one